Good morning, Pranavi. Good morning, Machina. How are you? Good, how are you? I'm fine. What are you going to be presenting today? I'm going to present a play on telephone etiquette. Okay, perfect. You can begin. One day, a girl is doing homework alone and the telephone rings. Ring, ring, ring. The child says, hello, may I know who is speaking? The stranger says, are you at home? Child, may I know who is speaking? The stranger says, is anyone home? Child, please tell me who you are now. The stranger says, where are your parents? Child, if you don't tell me who you are, I'm calling 911. Stranger, fine, but I'll get you someday. Telephone quick. Silence from the stranger then. The girl panics. The girl is the, the girl will call the parents now. Parents, hello? Hi, mom and dad. A stranger calls and asks a bunch of questions. The parents say, what? Honey, are you all right? The girl said, yeah, but he said he would get me. The parents say, hang on, we're coming. This girl did the right thing. Why did she do the right thing? She did not give the stranger any, like, access information so he was kidnapped or anything. Very good. And why is that important? So you won't get kidnapped and, yeah. You won't get hurt, right? Do you think that that happens a lot? Do a lot of people know about the proper t um, etiquette for the telephone? No. No. So what happens then? They get kidnapped and hurt. They get kidnapped and hurt, right? So we're trying to, through this lesson, prevent that from occurring, right? Yeah. And teach you guys what? How to? Manage the stranger on the phone. Good. And can you do the um, opposite, like the bad way of what could have happened? Mm -hmm. One day a girl is doing homework alone when the telephone rings. Ring, ring, ring. Hello, may I know who's speaking? Are you at home? Yes, I'm at home and no one is at home. The stranger says, where's your mom? She's at the doctor with my dad. The stranger says, do you have any dogs? Yeah, I have one dog who is sleeping right now. The child says, bye. The stranger says, bye. The telephone goes click and the child continues doing homework. Okay, but what could happen then? The stranger could ring the doorbell and just kidnap her. Mm-hmm. Good. Because if the stranger doesn't ask exactly what your address is, could they know what your address is? Not really, but I guess they would have caller ID. Or... They would have caller ID, and if they know your telephone number, they could probably look up your address as well, correct? Yes. Yes. So, what is the one thing that you want everyone to learn from this activity? Never to give any um, strangers information about what you, like, if you're at home and your parents are not home. Very good. Say good job, Pranavi. Good job, Pranavi. Thank you, friends.